Introduction to Arithmetic Operations Arithmetic operations are fundamental mathematical calculations performed in Excel to analyze and manipulate data. These operations help in tasks such as budgeting, data analysis, and reporting. The operations covered in this lesson include addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. Addition in Microsoft Excel is one of the most basic yet powerful arithmetic operations, commonly used in everyday tasks involving numbers, especially when working with financial records, inventory counts, budgeting, or general data analysis. It combines two or more numbers to produce a total sum. The formula syntax for addition is, start with an equal sign, followed by the cell reference A1, then the plus symbol, and then the cell reference B1. For example, if cell A1 contains the number 5 and cell B1 contains the number 3, then typing equal sign A1 plus B1 will give you the result 8. A practical use case for addition is calculating total sales by summing revenue from different products. Subtraction in Microsoft Excel is a fundamental mathematical operation used to determine the difference between two values, and it is especially helpful when analyzing losses, reductions, or comparing quantities across data sets. Subtraction finds the difference between two numbers by removing one from the other. The formula syntax for subtraction is, begin with an equal sign, followed by the cell reference A1, then the minus symbol, and then the cell reference B1. For example, if cell A1 contains the number 10 and cell B1 contains the number 4, then typing equal sign A1 minus B1 will give you the result 6. A practical use case for subtraction is calculating remaining inventory after recording product sales. Multiplication in Microsoft Excel is a key arithmetic function used to calculate the total when the same value is repeated multiple times, making it especially useful for financial, statistical, or inventory-related tasks. Multiplication combines equal groups of numbers to calculate the total. The formula syntax for multiplication is, begin with an equal sign, followed by the cell reference A1, then the asterisk symbol, which represents multiplication, and then the cell reference B1. For example, if cell A1 contains the number 7 and cell B1 contains the number 6, then typing equal sign A1 times B1 will give you the result 42. A practical use case for multiplication is calculating total revenue by multiplying the unit price by the quantity sold. Division in Microsoft Excel is a fundamental mathematical operation used to separate a quantity into equal portions, making it essential for calculating averages, ratios, or distributing resources evenly in data analysis. Division splits a number into equal parts, determining how many times one number fits into another. The formula syntax for division is, start with an equal sign, followed by the cell reference A1, then the forward slash symbol, used for division, and then the cell reference B1. For example, if A1 contains the number 20 and B1 contains 5, then typing equal sign A1 divided by B1 will give the result 4. A practical use case for division is finding average sales per day by dividing total sales by the number of days. Order of operations. Excel follows the order of operations, often remembered by the acronym PEMDAS, which stands for parentheses, exponents, multiplication and division, addition and subtraction. For example, in the formula equals sign 2 plus 3 times 4, Excel calculates 3 times 4 first, resulting in 14, not 20. Understanding this is crucial for correct calculations in complex formulas. Combining operations. You can combine different arithmetic operations in a single formula to perform complex calculations. For example, equal sign A1 plus B1 times C1. If A1 equals 2, B1 equals 3, and C1 equals 4, the calculation will be equal sign 2 plus 3 times 4, resulting in 14. A practical use case for combining operations is adjusting budgets by adding income and subtracting expenses. Common errors. One common error is division by zero. If you attempt to divide by zero, Excel will display the error code number div slash zero. For example, equal sign A1 divided by zero results in an error. Always check that the denominator is not zero before performing division. Another common error is using incorrect data types. Using text in arithmetic operations can lead to errors. For example, equal sign A1 plus text will return an error if A1 contains a number. In conclusion, mastering basic arithmetic operations in Excel is essential for effective data analysis. I encourage you to practice these operations regularly to build confidence and proficiency.